Okay, the objectives in this video is to explain equilibrium three dimensionally and two dimensionally, um, show you a bit of free body diagrams, and finally explain to you equilibrium plus a free body, um, sorry, present to you an equilibrium and free body diagram example. So initially, the following is a three dimensional XYZ Cartesian coordinate system. So as you can see, we have the X axis over here, we've got the Y axis over here, and the Z axis over here. So, um, in equilibrium, the main forces we deal in are moments and forces. So, as you can see, the x-axis has a moment about the x-axis and the force about the x-axis over here. The y-axis has a force about the y-axis and a moment about the y-axis over here, as you can see. And finally, the z-axis has a force about the z-axis and a moment about the z-axis. Okay? So, in this course, the notation is positive moments are anti-clockwise, negative moments are clockwise. So if you see a twisting force that is anti-clockwise or, uh, or a moment force which is anti-clockwise, it's taken as a positive, but if you see a moment force which is clockwise, you take it as a negative. Okay? To do force equilibrium, the following is done. We can do the sum of forces in the horizontal direction is equal to zero, or the sum of forces in the y direction is equal to zero, or the sum of forces in the z direction is also equal to zero. To do moment equilibrium, we do the sum of moments about the x-axis, sorry, we do the sum of moments about x is equal to zero, the sum of moments about y is equal to zero, and the sum of moments about